as the church are called to build a civilization of love and life. And so we need to have meaning so we can have hope, so we can go and live the life that I believe God is calling us to live. Jesus gave everything. He didn't hold anything back. If you could see with everything that you are, in the bodies and every single person, a living embodiment of God, how would it change the way in which you see them, talk to them, interact with them? Would it make a difference? Yes. Courage is not the absence of fear. Courage is doing what is right in spite of your fear. God has a deep, deep desire for you. He's got a beautiful dream for you. If we don't discover who we are, it can be a very confusing place to live. If you are a parent with teenagers, just ask them. We don't want things twisted around. We want to know the truth about things. Our goal is to take what we learn here and go out to the world, live our life there. Can anybody find me? Somebody love. She's singing another song, guys. You know what she's singing? Oops, I did it again. I play with your heart. Oh, I'm so sorry. Ah! Right, no, you're not gonna die, I promise you. She's so beautiful! Right? Oh, bleeding, you know, your eyes, oh, oh my gosh, heart, heart, heart pounding, right? Coming out of your chest, oh my gosh, right? And your girlfriend's, oh, okay, fine, I'll go talk to you, right? <laughs> Look at me! <laughs> it's singing, right? Hallelujah! Any of you want to see God right now? Good. I need a guy and a girl volunteer. <laughs> we'll give it to him. Anybody want this? But if you will go to him and you will trust him, he will take our brokenness. He will put it into his sacred heart and he will make all things new. And Love Actually has a fourfold acronym, and the ac acronym is FTFF, or <laughs> Well, say it back to me. Free, total, faithful, fruitful. Perfect. The Word has been made flesh, and if God takes on flesh, takes on a body, it means something. Are you hearing this in the movies you're seeing? In your television shows? Are you talking like this? No. If we're hearing this in our family, it's beautiful. The Father is pleased with me after all I've done, all my running, all my using? How? And this is mercy. I work with those who are involved in pornography, attraction, and compulsion. Boom, 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 boom. These chains hit the floor. The desire to want to use my sisters was transformed by a desire to want to serve them. Principles last forever. And what I want to give you are principles in which you can go to the bank with. You are able to bank on this and know this is what is true, this is what's real. And so the union of husband and wife on earth is a foreshadowing of the union between Christ and his church in heaven. Is this not what we want? Is this not what is the fulfillment of our deepest desires? To enter into union and communion with others forever in a joy that never ends. And this is the hope and promise of the resurrection. This is the hope and promise of the desires that you have in you. So fear not. Enter and give them to Christ. Allow him to redeem them so you may live and fulfill the very meaning of your being and existence. Amen? And if we're made in the image of God and if we want to be happy, then guess what? We must learn how to be a gift. Make a gift of yourself.